Blessings and welcome to the Chakra Clearing Meditation. Find yourself a comfortable place to sit or lie down with your back strong and straight like a mountain. For those of you that don't know, your chakras are seven points of energy that are located in the body. And in this meditation, you will meet the eighth chakra called Bindu that is not often talked about. More on that later. They are lined down a center I call the core light. This core light allows the energy to flow up and down the body. The chakras are responsible for distributing our life energy. They have names in Sanskrit, but to make this meditation easily understood, I will use the English names. Now, let's become aware of our body by connecting with the breath. You can place your hands on your belly and notice how the belly expands on the inhale and contracts on the exhale. As you inhale now, hold it for a count of four and exhale to the count of eight. Let's do this three times. Inhale, two, three, four, hold, two, three, four, exhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and inhale, two, three, four, hold, two, three, four, exhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and inhale, two, three, four, hold, two, three, four, and exhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ah, and soften the breath, notice how the breath cycles in the body, now landing gently in your body, bring your awareness to your head, Soften the forehead, eyes, release the jaw, parting the lips slightly. Feel the tension just melt away. Moving down into the neck, shoulders and back, this area that holds so much tension. Feel into the space, noticing any areas of tension. As you notice these areas, breathe into them, giving healing and oxygenating them. Now let's move to the right arm, hands, fingers, then the left arm, hands, fingers, breathing deeply into these spaces. Now the chest, torso, stomach and pelvic bowl, holding space in the sacred area, breathing into any tension and noticing what comes up for you. Let's go to the left leg, knee, 
foot and toe. Now the right leg, knee, foot and toes. Just relaxing each muscle as we breathe. Let's bring awareness to the whole body. Noticing any sensations or discomfort and breathing into those areas. Now we give ourselves permission to just relax and receive the healing we need. Today, we are taking a journey. We are walking along a magical road that has several mazes on it. Let's begin. You may feel the presence of an angel or a guide who has chosen to come along. Invite them in as we choose to clear our energetic bodies. The path is made of bright, white, divine light. You can feel your feet warm as you step onto the path. This is your core light. It is taking you inwards to your body, directly to your sacred centers. Starting at the base of your spine and pelvic bowl, you notice in the distance a pulsating red light. As you approach this light, you can see it sits in the center of a maze. Stepping into the maze, you see you have a key. This key will unlock the door to your root chakra. As you open the door, step into the maze. Walking slowly, you become aware that you are opening the chakra and can feel its petals unfurl as you walk. Reaching the center of the maze, you find a glowing ruby red treasure chest. You unlock this chest with your key. Peering inside, you see an inverted red triangle within a glistening yellow square. These are symbols of energy and solidity. They enhance your inner stability and balance. These are your cosmic gifts. As you pick them up, your guides come forward and start to blow clearing air through each part of the maze. Cleaning and clearing the chakra. You can feel the chakra pulsating, pure light energy as it is now clean and clear. Walking backwards through the maze, you close the root chakra. Finally reaching the door with your gifts, you close and lock it gently. This chakra is now clean and clear. Stepping back onto the bright white light of your core light, you journey upwards. You begin to see a bright orange light, like that of a sunset on a summer evening. 
Knowing that the maze is near, you approach the door, and again the key appears in your hand. You slowly unlock the door and begin to open the sacral chakra as you stroll peacefully through the maze. Reaching the center, you find a clementine orange treasure chest. You can smell the scent of oranges in summertime. Eagerly opening the chest, you are marveling to find inside a vast, deep ocean with dark waves beneath the night sky. The tides of the ocean represent the ebb and flow of awareness. This gift feels deeply nourishing. Holding it and placing it in the body, your own awareness is drawn to your team of guides and aides who have always been there with you across all lifetimes. Your heart feels the love they have for you. They breathe in and exhale, clearing all the density and blocks within the chakra. Walking backwards, you close the chakra, knowing now it is clean and clear. Closing the door and moving up the core light. You come to a bright yellow crystalline light. The door is made of citrine. You can sense the ancient wisdom that is being held behind this door. The key in your hand is golden. You unlock the door and as you enter the maze of the solar plexus chakra, you realize that you are not alone. You are surrounded by the ancient keepers of our primal wisdom. Walking with you, they help you to unlock and open the chakra. When you get to the center of the maze, there is a blazing sun, a ball of red hot fire. You feel this amazing feeling. Your entire being comes alive as you experience this energy in the form of light, expanding and permeating the whole body. The keepers hand you a tiny point of light which dissolves right into your solar plexus. Keepers and your guides create a light that begins to shine, touching each part of this chakra, clearing and cleansing it fully. Walking backwards, as you close the chakra, you reach the door. Just before you close it, the keepers give you a message. Hear their message now. Closing the door and giving thanks for their wisdom, you step again onto the core light pathway, walking up filled with love and gratitude, you notice that you are floating, it feels like there are soft clouds beneath your feet, then you hear sounds like a deep drumming sound. 
accompanied by the song of your ancestor, a song your soul knows so well. The song is so beautiful, you sit on the green grass outside the store, just listening to it for a while. Slowly, you get up and walk to the door, but this time you don't have a key, so you knock and the door opens. Behind the door are all your ancestors lining the way across the maze. They say welcome home. Walking into the maze of the heart chakra, they sing. You reach the center of the chakra. In the middle, you see the most beautiful lotus and floating above it, what looks like an ancient symbol. It's a blue hexagon formed by interlacing triangles with a tiny bright green flame burning in the center. This symbol is your gift. Your ancestor's song becomes louder and louder, so loud as your guides use the song to clear and clean the heart chakra. You walk backwards through the maze. You feel the heart chakra seal. Your ancestors close the door behind you. You leave knowing you can always return. With their song in your head, you walk down the core light humming their tune. Reaching the door to the throat chakra, a hummingbird, colored like a blue-green gem, drops the key in your hand. This place is magical. You can feel the pure potential as you walk through the maze. You can hear people speaking in all the languages of Earth and the languages of all the realms. Reaching the center, you see the most magnificent moon flower. Underneath the flower stands an archangel holding a silver chalice. You ask the archangel, who are you? They answer in a language that you can feel echoing throughout your body. They hand you the silver chalice. It is filled with large drops of white nectar from the moonflower. As you take a sip of this icy cold sweet nectar, you begin to feel a blissness, a sensation so blissful, warming it throughout the body. As you take this all in, you feel the angelic realm filling the chakra with sweet nectar, clearing away any density and blockages.
the voice of the angels clearing the throat chakra. Walking backwards, you reach the door and close the door, sealing it with love and light. Stepping back onto the pathway, you look back and can see all the chakras pulsating, fully clean and clear. Now looking forward, you walk up the core light, inhaling deeply. We see a bright purple amethyst colored light. As you follow the light, you reach the door to the maze and see the all-knowing cosmic eye peering down at you, welcoming you into the third eye chakra. Walking through the maze, reaching the center, you see a tiny point of light and above it floats the arm symbol. Looking deeply into the symbol, you see a mirror it reflects your image, reminding you of your own inner guru. You hear yourself speak. It's you, your guru. And now you share wisdom with yourself. This wisdom is something that you need to know now to move forward. Taking this knowledge within you, you walk backwards, closing the chakra as it clears out with your inner wisdom. It is now clean and clear. Stepping back on the path, you are met by your spirit animal. And instead of going up, you go into towards the pineal gland. This is the sacred hidden chakra, Bindu, smiling like a Cheshire cat, the base of the skull. The animal whispers in your ear, I'm going to take you somewhere sacred, to the forgotten chakra, Bindu. Walking through, using the core cool light, you enter a maze. This one has no door, but you can feel it transform and open as you walk through it. Reaching the center, you see a tiny crescent moon on the darkest night. It looks like the Cheshire Cat's grin in Addison Wonderland. He says, shh, concentrate on the sacred sounds within Listen to your psychic vision. Your animal guide takes you to a tree. You reach your hand into the tree to touch it. 
and the Aum symbol moves onto your hand, this is your gift. Give thanks. You begin to walk backwards while you see a huge flock of birds clearing and cleansing the chakra. Reaching the start of your maze, your animal guide bids you farewell as you begin your journey up and up and up into your higher consciousness. The core light path is pulsating. You notice the pathway is lined with archangels and angels, white lights and blue, your ancestors and your guides. You reach this doorway. There at the door, you meet the divine. Knowing how special this place is, you take your time savoring every feeling, emotion, sensation, sight, the maze is a cosmic spiral. As you reach the center, you see a shining lotus. This lotus has a thousand petals containing all the sacred knowledge of the universe and of your beingness. At the center, there is a ligam of light the symbol of pure consciousness. You look at your body and notice that it is getting brighter and brighter. The light is a gift from the divine, opening your connection to them. The spiral is spinning and the crown chakra is opening wide, bringing in cosmic knowledge and energy from the divine. You start to walk backwards through the spiral, knowing that you are forever protected and it is clean and clear. Reaching the pinnacle point, you see the beautiful golden flow of your energy beaming up through each chakra, starting at the root, then the sacral, solar plexus, the heart, the throat, third eye, and bindu, and finally the crown, cascading over the body and down into Pachamama, back through the root, all your chakras are now clean and clear. Let's just take this moment in to feel this renewed energy flowing up through the core light, out through the crown, into Pachamama, and back up through the root. And we can do this following the breath. With the inhalation, it goes up, and the exhalation back to Pachamama. Inhalation, up through the body, igniting the fire, and exhalation into Baba. Inhale, exhale. Now, there has been so much sacred messaging. You may want to write this down as soon as you come out of this meditation. So let's slowly come back to this dimension. Coming back, coming back, coming back. Now you see, coming back, you begin to notice all the sounds in this 3D dimension. You can wiggle your fingers and toes, coming back. Take a deep breath. Hold it, two, three, four, and exhale. 
exhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, a grounding deep breath in, two, three, four, we hold it, two, three, four, and exhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then inhale, two, three, four, holding while we wake up, four, and sighing out the breath, five, six, seven, eight. Welcome home, slowly, stretch the body, opening your eyes, and land in the present moment. Rest in this beautiful sensation. The sensation that is flowing through your body. And when you are ready, you can carry on giving a big stretch, grounding you and bringing you home to this dimension. Sending you love and light, Lauren Astara. You could use this chakra meditation as often as you need. Please subscribe to my channel. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Blessed be.